All right. What is up, my fellow? Call of Duty, Elite Gaming, Stud Muffin, Athlete. Welcome to another amazing video. I'm the Ghost of Fate. I'm happy here. Hope you're doing great. We got Doc, 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 Doc. This, 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 this. Respect up in here. Absolutely coming off the dog ropes like an absolute savage. Drop with an elbow smash. Oh, yeah. On the Activision Call of Duty. God, God out here let no one survive the holocaust of the top level elite game and athletes enough is enough we've had enough everyone's talking about it strap in right now for the most amazing video ever done in call of duty history smash that like button make sure to subscribe while you're here all right all right let's get a hold of ourselves let's comment down a little bit here because we got to talk about some serious business happening right now so dr dis 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 disrespect laid down an absolute gauntlet of truth well, you know what, listen, I've been saying the same thing he's saying because we're both alpha male, six foot something, six foot six, six, eight, just, I mean, jacked out of our minds, testosterone boosted with Mexican supplements, alpha male type fucking studs, and we, we you know, great minds think alike. But he has laid down a gauntlet, and obviously he's got a bigger platform than me, so it's going to carry a lot further. The signal boost, and it'll be very strong. And I wholeheartedly agree with what he says here. And what does he say? Well, he says this. Activision pushing water bongs, marijuana, get high levels, drugs, and $100 camels on gamers. But they removed Nick Merck's skin for him saying, leave the kids alone. Activision is ran by a bunch of idiots. Actually, I think you should have said, dog, Activision is run by a bunch of beta male liberal cuck ass woke agenda of making taken bitches. Biggest suit and tie phonies in the industry. And I did do a video about this earlier, uh, talking about how they were promoting drugs and all kinds of stuff with the Cheech and Chong, put all this effort into 420, blaze it, marijuana culture, and everything in between. But yet, you also have your voice being constantly monitored by Big Brother. If you say a bad word, oh my God, God forbid you say the naughty word, you can get banned or shadow banned. Well, not shadow banned, but you get voice banned, and you actually just get kicked off the whole damn platform, and you get boom, kicked out to outer space with Elon Musk and the flat earth. But yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. I will say here, I will say this. Let me just keep it real. I don't know if you guys know about what the facts and the jacks and stuff that's been going around. Perhaps maybe you're new to this channel you're not really privy to the whole history and the whole backstory of eight thoughts goes to vape and everything in between but Nick Merckx is a bit of a bitch. I'm just going to say that. I don't know if you know, but 8 Thoughts, which I'm not. I'm the ghost of 8. We are no way related in any way whatsoever. Had a huge channel, 400,000 subscribers. It was making fun of Nick Merckx because his thumbnails were like, And I got news for you. That means you're gay. With his mouth wide open, you guys see all the thumbnails. Yeah, and 8 Thoughts said that Nick Merckx looked like he's you know trying to suck a BBC. And he made jokes about it. And Nick Merckx got upset about that and was like, Oh, no, I can't. Somebody making fun of my thumbnails. So he openly admitted, videos, you can go to my channel where I show, he openly admits that he struck 8 Thoughts, huge mega channel, more amazing than Nick Merckx's channel was. That's why he's probably upset because he realized that 8 Thoughts content was much superior to his weak-ass content. And he struck his channel for uh, some, I guess, getting his feelings hurt and, you know. Nonetheless, I do agree. I agree totally wholeheartedly. I even have made videos supporting Nick Merckx and that his opinions on the matter of Leave the Kids Alone and Activision taking his skin out of the game and how it all played out and that whole kind of uh, red pill, which is kind of, you know, cringe nowadays to say, but the whole red, red pill mentality of staying woke against the freaking liberal hive mind woke agenda ridiculousness totally agree with that trump 2024 it doesn't really matter it's an illusion of choice the system's all going down we're all fucked no matter what a president for four years ain't gonna really change as a matter of fact might save you money in the short term might make the economy better but then someone else comes in and then it's like reptilian shapeshifter power slam all over again coming out and hanging bohemian grove where the worship house and the moon landing was fake but Dr. Respect, keeping a real pack of steel. I've said the same thing. I made some videos about it as well. It's nice to see. I'm not the only stud out here. It's because we're grown men. We're adults. We're not little beta male bitches out here buying hard our skins and thinking, Joe, this is an amazing gamer. And hey, Joe, how many people are cheating in the Call of Duty Warzone streaming scene? Zero. And then bams, all our guys keep getting bad with the new ricochet system being up kept and being pushed up and having to actually increase its, uh, you know, virility. It's amazing. Now, speaking of Joe, let's just break into something before we get out here this is absolutely hilarious this freaking beaker looking call of duty gamer he actually does have a pretty good sense of humor doesn't take himself too seriously and i respect that about himself he knows he's a dork he knows he plays call of duty for a living he knows he makes a ton of money he seems pretty grateful for what he has and uh, you know hey listen he's gonna stick up for his other reptilian shape shift and activision shill cheaters i dig it i get it you know what i'm saying they're a group obviously you're not gonna throw anyone else under the bus when you guys got a million dollars being made on a daily basis out here and well maybe a monthly basis weekly basis you would be surprised how much money these guys make and i get it i you know listen he's 
He's not going to throw his team underneath the bus when he says there's zero people cheating. I can, I, you know, listen, I understand. The guy's still a fucking dork. And what he's doing now is even funnier. This beaker looking gamer, absolutely hilarious. You guys got to see this guy is, this dude is peddling, I guess it's in the South. I don't know. Bojangles. The food looks like diarrhea. It looks absolutely hilarious. But the video of him actually like trying to, uh, you know, promote this. Bro, this advertisement is so <laughs> Crits, dude. Absolutely hilarious. All right, here we go, guys. Hey, guys, I'm Joe, and I'm just about you and, and, and chicken showers, bro. This is awesome. What's up, guys? What's Joe up, here. guys? I'm excited to announce that I'm partnering with Bojangles. Okay, bro, bro, time out, time out. Whoever wrote this ad needs to be fired. You're putting way too many yeses in there for Joe. What's up, guys? I am excited to produce. I am partnering with Bojangles. Dolly, start that over. Whoever's writing this script. You got fired, dude. You can't put that many S's when you're dealing with Joe-O, okay? What's up, guys? Joe-O here, and I'm excited to announce that I'm partnering with Bojangles and Mountain Dew. Now, I'm going to shake your game up with my free Joe-O Supreme. Okay, that looks like snot, dude. That looks disgusting, bro. Listen, I don't like Mountain Dew either. Mountain Dew's gross. I don't know. It's obesity in a freaking can. Gross. That looks that looks nasty. Like, listen, Beaker. Come on, bro. That dude looks like Beaker. Like, as my one friend's Baron Von Tourette said, it looks like he definitely had a hard birth. Undo. Now, all you have to do is use code JOWO on the Bojangles app and get a free three what piece is he doing? chicken supremes. Now, make sure to download. Dude, why is this guy so happy to be putting chicken in the box? It's a chicken in a box. Bro, this guy have a, must have a very large black uh, community that supports him. What is what is this chicken, fried chicken shit, man? Like, when he, like, gets, like, the sauce, puts it in there. Who does that? Is that, like, a thing? Because that's disgusting. I'm mean, going to just dip the chicken strip and eat it. It's like people, listen, I'm going to tell you right now. I may lose some fans here. Some of you guys might get your feelings all up in their hurtness here. I got to keep it real with you guys. Anybody who takes ketchup and just dumps it on their fries instead of, like, taking one and individually dipping it, you're a psycho. You are you are crazy. The app, use code JOWO, oh select God. Mountain Dew as your drink, and let's unlock new levels together. So the offer is limited to one per user, and it is available for a limited time only through the Bojangles app at Purchase. Oh, yeah, this is so tasty, guys. Mmm, Bojangles, dig in. Awesome. I hope I get a hit for this clip for this. Bojangles, give me some money residue resolutions, some kind of, uh, you know, renumination, some kind of, you know, listen, I need some money. That's all I'm trying to say. I'm helping you guys making this look awesome. Guys, I eat Bojangles, and I look like this. If you want to look like this eat bojangles if you want to look like jaywell whose mom obviously had a hard birth with him and made his head look like a cone head i a beaker cone heads remember that starting at live dan Aykroyd. if you get that hit that like button leave a comment down below let me know i might pick you to be a winner give you some cod points so you can go waste on some awesome 420 blaze and shit you know what i'm saying bro you know what they should do with cod points they should sell like cod points and then like with the cod points you could buy like let's say less skill based matchmaking proper pin connection lobbies bro i'll tell you right now I wouldn't pay for that shit because I'm not a sucker. Should be free. Should come with the game. I'm the ghost of Vate. Thank you for watching the video. You know it was awesome. I'm awesome. Hope you have yourself a great day. Last but not least, if you don't subscribe, hit that like button. You're going to get diabetes and die from eating too much Bojangles or diabetes. Obesity? You'll be like Wings of Redemption. Just fucking.